So those are the starting lineups for this 18 and under boys gold medal game tier one at the 2024 Volleyball Canada Club Nationals. Got the Pac-Men gold out of Ontario. They'll be in the black and gold. And the Nukes Volleyball Club from right here in Edmonton in the blue and the gold. Should be a great one between these two teams. One of them gonna be crowned a national champion. So glad you could join us here. Grayson Knutson with you. They got a lot to live up to. That 18 and under girls final was an epic three set showdown. Congratulations once again to the Halton Hurricanes for winning that one. There's the Pac Men gold. Their libero, number four, Parker Ocampo, will wear white. Meanwhile, for the Nukes, their libero is number three, Gabriel Coslo, who's also in a white shirt here today. Pac Men gold, 8 and 0. Oh. So far at this event, they're looking to stay perfect. The Nukes, six and two. Took the long way around, but got here to the final. Some great matches earlier today in this boys 18U category. Talk about the road to the finals a little bit later on, but to get us going here, it's the captain for Pac-Man Gold. This is Christopher Tautrams. Ready to get us underway in this championship final. There's a back row swing to start things off from Spencer Lukey, but that goes out the back of the first point. Goes the way of the team from Mississauga. Tatrum's ready to fire it once again. Big toss for that spin serve, but it goes out the back. Both teams on the board now. As you would suspect, there are maybe a few more fans here for the Nukes. Their first server will be number eight, Ethan Field. Middle attack, good readjustment. Mid-air there by Luka Minnick. Looked like he wanted to go up and hammer that thing. Didn't like the set, didn't like what he saw perhaps, and you see the little readjustment there. Really nice from Minnick. Now it'll be the number eight back at the service line for Pac-Man Gold. Floats one over. Nukes, big swing there, nice pass. And that one is going to be a point for the local side on a reach over. Initial swing there from Lex Symes, number 11. You can see Tian Ersevic trying to rescue that one, but not a lot of hope trying to do that. Owen Harris now for Nukes. 
Back row look, dug up nicely by Field. Played over, kept alive once again as the two teams get into the first lengthy rally of the game and a nifty play there by Wyatt Hall. Setter for Nukes. Just going with the dump that time into the soft spot in the defense. 3-2, Nukes in front. Another serve from Harris. That's an ace. Oh, and Harris. Another look at his last bomb before he gets ready to fire away again. Tried to take something off that one. Winds up putting it into the net. 4-3. Nukes in front here. Server for Pac-Man is T and Harsevic. There's a back row look into a triple block. However, the Pac-Man block was on the net. And so we've got a point for Nukes. You see right there, middle blocker just caught the top of the tape on his way down. So here's Wyatt Hall. Middle attack there, dug up by Hall. Signs off the block, good reaction from Basilio. Good dig there by Field, can they track it down? No, they can't. Hall almost wound up in the first row there, trying to race after that one. Serving now for Pac-Man, William Basilio. Free ball chance here for Pac-Man. Where will they go? To the back row and a good dig again by Field keeping it alive. Hall tracks it down and team from Mississauga can attack once more. Another attempt for Basilio, partially blocked. Now it's Symes into the net. 5 apiece early on. High ball to the outside for Symes and there's a tall wall in front of him wound up putting it into the net anyway. Basilio. Caught the tape. Here come Pac-Man again. Lots off of field. And it will carry him out of bounds. A heavy swing from Matt Mowbray, the number three on the near side. Pac-Man go in front. Basilio continuing this run of serve here. And good try by Hall, but it hit the official, so that's out of bounds. And the Pac-Man keep rolling along. Basilio ready to let fire once again here. Change up that time. And Basilio drops it in for another point. And a timeout going to be taken by Taylor Pocock and the Nukes. That one just out of the reach of the defenders. And what a run here for William Basilio and the Pac-Man Gold. 8-5, they lead it. We're down 5-3 not that long ago. Here's a look at the Nukes. Their head coach, Taylor Pocock, of course. They defeated... Kingston Waterloo, Predators Legacy 2-0 in the quarterfinals. Both those sets by just two points. Then they defeated the Quebec team's Titan Essor in three sets in the semifinals. Meanwhile, Pac-Man Gold took on the Hurricanes in the quarters. They needed three sets, 20-18 in the third just to get by them. Then they defeated KVA Pac Black out of BC 
2-0 in the semifinal. 8-5, Pac-Man in front. And once again, it's Basilio. Can he keep things rolling along? Middle attack that time, and good reaction from Pac-Man to keep it alive. Another middle look, and this time, Will Clark puts it away. Great reaction from Pac-Man defensively, but a second bite of the cherry for Clark, and he took advantage. Now here's Lex Symes. Great pass there from Ocampo! And then it was absolutely hammered home. What a big time kill. Another look at it here. Great set from Arcevic for Matthew McCarville. Now McCarville will serve. High ball for Field, just pokes it over. That one from Tautrams, didn't catch fingertips, goes out the back. Point for Nukes. Nukes Volleyball Club, associated with Nate, Northern Alberta Institute of Technology. A collegiate squad here in Edmonton. Tautrams gets it through the block and down for another point for Pacman. Long set all the way out to him and see the middle blocker there just not quite over in time and pressed over the net. And then right back at you, Owen Harris. Trying to get the crowd fired up as he knocked it off the noggin of Ocampo. Spencer Lukey now for Nukes. Middle run, slam dunk, Luka Minnick. One more look at this middle attack from Pac Men. Minnick just dunks it home. And Tautrams, captain for Pac Men Gold. His team up by three here in this opening set. And look out, camera guy. That's going to get away from the Nukes players. And another ace for Tautrams and Pac Men Gold. Tautrams ready to let it fly once again. Just wide. Nukes will take the freebie and send Ethan Field back to do the serving. Field the number eight, ready to fire. That'll go out the back. Trying to find that fine line between an aggressive serve and keeping it in play, forcing the other team to do something with it. It's always the trick, isn't it? Here's Luka Minnick. Field rolls it from the back. Outside, Basilio goes deep with that shot. And is able to score another point. The lead for the team from Mississauga is now five. Another serve here for Minnick. And Nukes watch that one just go out the back. Field stepped up, turned around and you could tell he was just hoping that would keep floating, and it did. Just enough. Now Owen Harris. Oh, 
Middle attack and McCarville puts it away again. Great first pass, high ball for Harsevic. Sets up that middle run. And now the setter will toe the line. Packman with a free ball opportunity. Basilio poking at it. Field from the back. Caught the hands of the blockers, slowed it down, and Nukes get a point. One of those strange ones where you want to go up and block it, but if you don't touch it, it's probably an easy pass for a defender right behind you. Hall with the serve. Quick there, McCarvel scores again. Harsevic and McCarvel are on the same wavelength here early on in this match. Sixteen eleven. Pacman gold in the lead. Here's Basilio now. Had that run earlier that really gave the Pacman this advantage in this set. That one is going to score, courtesy of Will Clark. Able to rattle it off the block and down. There's Symes ready to serve up from the back once again. High ball for Tautrams off the block. Symes couldn't quite get that one up high enough. Frustration for head coach Taylor Pocock as he's going to use his second timeout of the set. So no more timeout for the Nukes as we see that last point again. Head coach Jesse Sadi and Pac-Man Gold enjoying a five-point lead here in this opening set. It's been very even except for that one run at the service line by Basilio on his last time around. There's a look at Nukes. Taylor Pocock, you can see squatted down there in the middle of that huddle. Nukes, six and two. 3-0 on the first day, 1-2 yesterday. Did enough to qualify for the Tier 1 quarterfinals. And a couple of tough matches earlier on, but made their way to the final. So it'll be McCarvel to serve for Pacman as we're back out of that timeout. Koslo plays it high and it just winds up going over the net. There's the block swatted right down by Lukey. Even when that free ball came over, Pacman were a little bit discombobulated, all bunched together. Not much of an approach there for Tatrams to deal with that set. Now he's Clark serving for Nukes. Kept alive by Ocampo. Tatrams plays it free. Here come Nukes. Outside and a big swing. And the follow through from Lukey took him onto the net. So that's going to result in a point for Pacman. See right there, he catches the top of the tape on the follow through. Serve from the left hander, Mowbray. Put right back by Minnick. Took full advantage of that overpass. Nineteen thirteen, Pacman, Lukey. There's a back row tip from Basilio, flying in his Coslo. Another free ball here for Pacman. Run a middle attack, and that one's going to score. Deep from the middle goes Minnick.
Substitution here on the Duke side. We're going to see number six, Caden Twininga, come in. He'll replace Symes. Try to just help shore up the serve receive here. Mowbray. Southpaw ready to fire again. There's the first touch for Twininga. Good pass, but the kill did it find the sideline. It did. Pac-Man were celebrating like it had gone out of bounds, but it did indeed find that sideline from Owen Harris. Another look at it here. Just catching it up for that white stripe. Serve from Lukey. All the way out for Tautrams. That's blocked. Another chance for Pac-Man. Tautrams again. Puts it in a good spot. Right in front of the defender. And you don't always have to hammer the ball. Sometimes placement will do the trick. Tautrams, Pac-Man up by seven in this opening set. Back row blocked. Up high, McCarvel. Or sorry, that's two, Basilio. Not 12. Also involved was Minnick. Tautrams again, serving for Pac-Man Gold. Didn't quite get on top of it the way he wanted. Flies out the back. Nukes will now look to field. Long way back for the team from Edmonton here in this opening set. Basilio right on the back line. Great spot from Basilio. Just able to catch enough of that white stripe. Here's Minnick. Back row all by himself there was Lukey. Nice dig by Mowbray. Nukes with another free ball chance. They go to the middle this time and it's blocked but out. Way out. Owen oh, Harris with a heavy swing. Harris will now go back to the service line. There's a back row look for Mowbray. Little sea ball run that time. And that brings up set point for Pac-Man. Good set from Harsevic once again. And it will be the number 14 serving, looking to close out this opening set. Back row, no blockers again on Lukey. But once again, the Pac-Man defend and they score. It's Basilio. 25-16. Pac-Man gold win the opening set fairly convincingly here. Over.
Two teams back on the floor here for set number two. Comfortable 25-16 victory in the opener for Pac-Man Gold. Hope you're enjoying our coverage here. Volleyball Canada, Sport Canada TV partnership. My name is Grayson Knudsen. Pac-Man Gold one set away from completing the perfect record here. They did lose three sets throughout the course of their previous eight matches, but looking to go 9-0 and and win a national title. Nukes will be the first server, and it's Wyatt Hall. This pops one over. Tautram's blocked, but it hit the antenna out of bounds, so a point for Pac-Man to get us going here in this second set. Captain Tautrams ready to go. Looks like that last attack that went off the antenna might have knocked it loose. So the down official, that's Jens Reyes, who's getting it organized. David Tam is our head official for this match. Now Tautrams is ready to go. Tight to the net, Hall tried to save it, and a net touch is gonna be called against Pacman. so nice work by Wyatt Hall to rescue that one from hitting the net. Another look at it here. Good adjustment midair too by Harris. Lex signs for Nukes. Took an unfortunate bounce there. Another millimeter or two higher, and that thing might trickle over. Luka Minnick for Pac-Man Gold. That one did get the fortuitous roll. It's been that kind of match so far for Pac-Man. 3-1 they lead here in this second set. Minnick once more. Big kill in the middle from Harris. Started with a good pass from the libero Coslo. And then Hall just a little back set for his big middle blocker. Now Harris will go back to the line. Big serve. Here's a look for Basilio. That will score. Three in the wall and they couldn't slow it down. One more look. Nukes read the ball was going out there but still couldn't stop Basilio from scoring. Now here's Tian Harsevic, the setter for Pac-Man. Arcevic digs it up. High ball for Mowbray. Partially blocked. Good play from Symes to try to keep it alive. And it just went a little bit too far for Lukey to try to rescue. Tian Harsevic ready to serve again here. I think that's going to be a reach called. Basilio got a little bit anxious there. Saw that ball was close to the net. This will be a great look from the net cam angle. 
Sees it coming and he wants to get his hands on it. Knock it down, but still on the Nukes side. That one trickled over. Now a chance for Nukes with a free ball. Field! On the left-hand side, Ethan Field with a big rip. Now Spencer Lukey, left-hander. Oh, what a kill! William Basilio right to the floor. It's one of the bigger swings we've seen so far in this match, and what a set, too, from Harsevic. A back set all the way across. Basilio serving. This was the rotation that gave Nuke some trouble in the first set. Basilio from the back! Back to back, huge points for Basilio. 7 4, Pac Man in the lead. Basilio ready to let fire once more. That went into the net from Lukey. And so there's an 8 4 lead now for. The team from Mississauga and a timeout by Taylor Pocock and the Nukes Volleyball Club. Similar script as we saw in that opening set. Pac-Man getting an early lead thanks to a run from Basilio at the line. Causing an early timeout for Nukes Volleyball Club. There's a look at the Pac-Man huddle. Very relaxed at the moment, as you would suspect. Nukes aren't out of it, that's for sure. We've seen some great comebacks. Some wild volleyball here. Pocock is animated in the huddle. Great crowd on hand here, too. They're yeah, starting to fill up the second level here. In Hall D at the Edmonton Expo Center. Home of the Edmonton Stingers of the Canadian Elite Basketball League. Opened up their regular season with a win down at Calgary yesterday in the Saddle Dome. Fun atmosphere there. I believe that set a lead record for attendance too. That match. Players ready, uh, ready to resume. Pardon me. And here's Basilio. That one will go wide. Maybe that timeout threw off the rhythm. Coach's point for Taylor Pocock. It'll be Ethan Field now for Nukes. Quick in the middle, great block! A solo stuff from Will Clark. We read that middle quick. Like a book. That's really well done. Nowhere for McCarvel to go. Another serve for Field. All the way out to Tautrams. Blocked. Another chance. Mowbray! Matt Mowbray with a big point there. There's the first block, and then they'll try the other side with Mowbray, and you can see Clark just a little bit late getting there to help out. McCarville serving, just got it over. Symes, and that was on the wrong side of the antenna. So that's out of bounds at a point for Pacman, in case you're wondering why they were so casual as that ball came towards them. They knew it was out of bounds. You'll get a look at it here. You can see it's on the other side of the antenna. So that's out of play. 10-6 pac men in front. That one from Clark just casually knocked it off the block and down. Press wasn't where it needed to be, and so Clark took advantage. 
This will be a great look. You see just how far the block is off the net. Allows that ball to hit it, trickle right down. Clark serving. Oh, just sliced on him and it went wide. Four point lead for Pac-Man Gold here as they look to Matt Mowbray. Southpaw serve. Hall trying to bring that one back, but just not unable or not able to. And so Mowbray will get credit with an ace. Tricky float serve from the big number three. Hits another one right at field. Big middle swing, Owen Harris. Nukes doing a lot of their damage with their middle attackers, both Clark and Harris. Here's the setter hall. Just a pop fly. Tatrums. Hall keeps it alive. Played over by Luki, and here come Pac Men. Middle attack put down by Minnick. Wasn't a loud, obnoxious kill from Minnick. Good adjustment, though, midair to put that one over to the side where the defense wasn't. Tatrums. Dunked right back down by Basilio. Lead growing here for Pac-Man. It's now up to six at 14 to eight. Another serve from Tatrams. That one from Symes comes back onto the Nuke side. Symes again, off the block, out of bounds. Point for the team from Edmonton. Substitution on the Nuke side. We're gonna see Symes come out. Caden Twininga will come back in. He will do the serving here as we look at that last point from Symes. Here's Twininga to serve. What a one-handed set that was. Unfortunately, Pac-Man were on the net. Arcevic did such a good job to pop this up with one hand. But then you can see the attacker all over the tape. Another serve for Twininga. Pac set off the block. And out of the reach of the defenders. Another point for Pac-Men as they stretch their lead. 15-10 is the score. And Luka Minnick, who just got that last point, as we look at it again, and is back at the service line. Hall oh, pops it up. Harris puts it down. Once again, Owen Harris. Noisy kills in the middle for number two. He'll go back to the service line now. Here's a back row look for Tautrums. Little pipe bomb works there. These two teams swinging hard all match long. Arcevic. Hall right in the wheelhouse there of Lukey. Kept alive. Basilio pops it over. Lukey second contact. Mupre! Wow! The ball all the way across was incredible. And Mowbray didn't miss. Pac Men are fired up. Timeout nukes. That was something else. Take another look at it here. 
Basilio just flings it across and it was right in the wheelhouse of Mowbray. 17-11, Pac-Men gold lead in this second set. Just a few points away from a national championship. Nukes trying to do everything they can, but looking overmatched at this exact moment. Still time to try to turn it around, but track's getting a little short. Players ready to return. See some of the other teams who have come to watch. Starting to stream out already. Again, it's a great atmosphere here in Hall D. One of 56 courts we're running here at the Edmonton Expo Center over the course of this event. Symes coming back in for Twininga on the Nuke side. 56 courts. Over 1,250 teams and 15,000 athletes taking part in this year's Club Nationals in Edmonton. Field caught the fingertips. Yes, it did. Point Nukes. This is the second wave of three. So we had one tournament run last Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Change over day Sunday. This event running Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. We'll have another changeover day tomorrow before our final group comes in for Friday, Saturday, Sunday. We'll have more commentated finals on Sunday from Hall D as well. Field over the block, but out the back. Point Pac-Men. Then nukes are out of timeouts here. Here's Basilio. Back row look and a great swing from Lukey. Another sea ball run for Nukes. And Lukey didn't miss. Now it'll be field. Into the net, tough one at this juncture of the match. Keeps that lead at six points. Here's Matthew McCarvel. There's a block, and it bounces back on the pac men's side. They'll call that second contact on Symes a lift. The one that came right off the block, right here. That is the lift. Good spot by David Tam, the head official here. Just an issue with the scoreboard if they gave the point to the wrong side there it should be 20 to 13 there we go now we've got her so McCarvel's ready to go Middle attack, blocked! Huge stuff, Luka Minnick. Pacman just continue to stretch this lead here, now up to eight. There's a back row look, another block! Minnick is fired up, and why not? His team three points away from a national championship. There is just no way through for the Nukes right now. Another serve for McCarvel. 
Symes. That's blocked as well. This was Mowbray. It's just an absolute wall that the Nukes are dealing with right now. Serve from McCarville once more. Another back row look. That one wasn't blocked. Pacman though can go on the attack. Tautrums. Smart play to wipe it off. Championship points for Pacman. Here's Matthew McCarville. Crowd making some noise. Good dig there by McCarville. Mowbray blocked and the Nukes stay alive. Still championship point, quite a few of them to work with here as Will Clark serves for Nukes. Will Clark gets an ace. That one just mishit by the defender. So Clark again. Back to back aces for Clark. It's a big hole for Nukes, but you love that they haven't gone away. Good serving from Clark. Can he do it again? Here come Pac Men. Tautrums wide. 24 17. Pac Men still just need one point, but that last one sure is hard to get sometimes, isn't it? Here's Clark once more. Back row Basilio. Good dig. Middle attack goes long. Point Pac-Man and they are national champions. Pac-Man goal go 9-0. And, oh. and they are the kings of the 18 and under boys tier one division. A tip of the cap of course to Nukes Volleyball Club. Silver medalist absolutely nothing to hang your heads about as Pac-Man get ready to celebrate. And of course, we've got the medal presentations. We'll hand out the Tournament All-Stars and the MVP as well. That's still to come. We'll go to the in-house announcer for that, but a dominant final here for Pac-Man Gold as they win 25-16, 25-17. There was that last point. The one that went long, and the celebration was on for Pac-Man Gold. So again, we've got some more volleyball action coming up on Sunday from Hall D. Actually, we'll be back Friday, Saturday, and Sunday with a whole whack of courts that have streaming. Play-by-play -play commentary for finals coming up on a Sunday afternoon, 3.50 Mountain Time. Hope you've enjoyed our coverage. Big shout out to our crew here. Choil, who's kind of running the show. We have Odell and Dave on camera, and Tyson, the replay switcher, director, all of the titles. Outstanding work from those guys. My name is Grayson Knudsen. Really appreciate you tuning in. Stick around. We're going to go to the in-house announcer for the post-game ceremonies. We'll hand out the medals, including the bronze medal as well, in this age group, and then the tournament all-stars and the MVP. So on behalf of all of us here,
Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the awards ceremony for the 2024 Volleyball Canada Nationals. TV category, congratulations to the Pac-15.